What's up, everybody? DJ Bucky here, previewing two of the more physical teams in the NFL squaring off this week. The Baltimore Ravens taking on the Carolina Panthers. Both these teams sit at four wins right now, Buck. And when we look for a matchup in this game, I think we go to the quarterback, Joe Flacco, matching up against one of the best defenders in the NFL, one of the most instinctive defenders in the NFL, and Luke Keekley. Yeah, when I look at this matchup, Joe Flacco has been a guy who has played really, really well this season. You look at the numbers, he's almost averaging 300 passing yards a game. Passer rating is right around average of the pack, around 85. But what he has, nine touchdowns, only four interceptions, completing almost 62% of his passes. He has found a connection with his playmakers, John Brown, Willie Sneed. He is beginning to get the ball outside, and we're seeing this team begin to score more points. Joe Flacco is playing well. I think he could be the catalyst to the Ravens finding a way to win this game. Well, let's look right down the middle of the field in this one, going up against Luke Keekley, still playing really at an elite level, Buck. He's such a fun player to study uh, when you watch him because he can do everything. You want somebody that can, can play the run inside at that linebacker position. That comes down to instincts, feel, watch him feel, fill, finish. That's what Luke Keekley brings to the table in the run game. And then I want to see his whole skill set on display right here. Watch him rush the quarterback. Again, it comes down to really a feel for him. Watch him kind of delay a count here. Let the hole open up. Find your lane. And once you do find your lane, wait, and then boom, shoot your gun. That's exactly what he does right there to get Carson Wentz on the ground, provide a big hit on the quarterback there. And then put him on the edge. You can stand him up a little bit. You want to rush him off the edge. He has the ability not only to be able to rush the passer a little bit here, but he can chase down plays in the run game. You want to run at him. He can hold up at the point. You want to run away from him. You see the speed there, close the back door, and finish. Luke Keekley still, Buck, after all these years, still playing at a very, very high level. Playing at a very high level. The defense is playing at a very high level. Thomas Davis is back. He and his partner, Luke Keekley do a great job of keeping everything kind of funneled in between those tackles, and they run it down and chase and knock the ball around. I like this defense. I like what Eric Reed has also brought. I'm going to go with the Carolina Panthers in this. The Baltimore Ravens have the better defense, but I believe the Carolina Panthers are a better overall team. I think that's the difference. Now, the Baltimore Ravens, I wish they were a little bit more committed to run the football, a little more successful there. I think you come in there somewhat one-dimensional against Carolina. That gets you in trouble. I'll go with you. I'll go with the Carolina Panthers in this game to get it done and, and maybe a little bit of a low-scoring game here with these uh, defenses smacking each other around here. Uh, and then, Buck, I'll tell you what, this game, after this game, I think we have a better feel for both of these football teams, how they stack up. All right, for more of our preview videos, go to NFL.com slash MTS video as well as YouTube.com slash NFL and check out the Move the Sticks podcast. We drop three episodes each and every week. You can find that on Apple Podcasts or your favorite podcast app.